welcome everybody to the 35th episode of the Pear Tree Podcast. And welcome to Ray Albee, Sandy. Hey Luke, hey everyone. I got you a strawberry tea. I hope you like it. Yeah, I've seen it. Thank you very much. I think I've quite had quite a few this week. Uh, I've got mango. Yeah. I just love the drinking them. I just love the little actions you do. And I've been waiting for food that you can consume for so long. It's great. I'm not amazingly convinced about bubble tea in real life, to be honest. I've only had it once and I liked it. So. What do the balls add to it, really? Maybe I just had a rubbish one, but they kind of, they, they didn't taste of anything. So the tea was really nice. Yeah. I don't know what I had. I, I never had it here because I don't know anywhere that does bubble tea here. But I got it when I was in Australia and it was really nice. But I have nothing to compare it to. It was just a nice cool drink when it was roasting. It was hugely popular so I guess maybe I just had a bad one. But I do like it in Animal Crossing. Yeah, you're right. You look so cute when you're drinking them. I um, wasn't quite ready for the how much that you need to go to the toilet when you're drinking lots of bubble tea and eating lots of candy floss. Oh, candy floss <laughs> and the, the ice lollies. I know, but now I'm quite, ha- I'm quite happy, but that was, I was quite surprised. But it's easy to... Um, and it's a cheap way to get um, the strain to like break rocks and lift up trees. That's true. Because usually I do turnips and I've missed turnips for so long, so... Yeah, that's true. It's handy, but yeah, <laughs> it's sometimes a bit an inconvenience because I just think it's so cute, especially when I see another villager eating or drinking. I'll just go up beside them and then I need to run to the toilet. Like you've made it. But I have put one outside now. Yeah, <laughs> you've made a cute little public toilet with a modesty screen, which I noticed when I popped over this week. Yeah, I don't own a toilet. I don't know if I purchase it. Sorry, I do. The office I've got ones in my, my house, but it's not something that I that I have anywhere in Ireland, but I'd made the golden one because I'm going through a DIY, so I just thought, why not? I'll just put that one out. Nice gold Perfect. screen in front of it. <laughs> yeah, I have always wondered why there wasn't a public toilet on the island, like in the museum or, I don't know, <laughs> around the back of residence services or something. Like in the museum? Yeah. There should be a public toilet in there, right? Yeah, I suppose, because you really should have somewhere... If you need it, especially if you eat turnips by accident. Yeah. I'm not sure if I fancy building like a toilet block. There's a portal loo, isn't there? Yeah, there is. you can't can use you... that as a loo. Oh, can you not? Oh, right, okay. I don't know. You I think can, it's a wardrobe. You don't change in it. Oh, do you? Oh, my goodness. Oh, you don't. Do you? I don't know. I can't, I've never... <laughs> I don't think I've ordered one no. before. It's going to be something I need to, just so I've got it in my catalogue now. Yeah. I can see it being a great item if you're making like a festival stage or something on your oh, island, yeah. but I've never thought this area needs a portaloo. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe someone can enlighten us as to whether you can actually go to the toilet in it or not. So what all you oh how was the fireworks? I missed the the get together for the fireworks. Yeah, oh, the fireworks were amazing. So much fun. I did spend quite a lot of it just watching myself eating candy floss though. And then I noticed uh, Apple eating an ice lolly and her mouth did the same little little O thing. And I'm doing it in the microphone there, but you can't see it, obviously. <laughs> um, and I've d- not noticed the, them looking so cute when they're eating before, but presumably they always have and I just haven't noticed. But yeah, the the way that your character looks when they're eating the candy floss and the lollies is so cute so most of the fireworks was like queuing up at reds to try and get all the like multiples of all the different drinks and food but also just hanging around on lots of different islands meeting lots of different villagers and enjoying the show it's my favorite event i love it so much yeah i never got to hang with any you or the friends but I did have a couple of nice pictures with all my villagers and sitting at the, the plaza. I actually went through with three of my characters because just to get all the head bobbers. 
fail as oh, much as nice. I could. Did you just get random ones from... Yeah, because I thought it was like the same. Because I was going to, when I opened up, I was going to write that I've got heart... Um, no, I was going to write star because that's what one of my other characters got. And then I think one of them got a flower and then I got the heart as well. So... Ah, uh, so... That's quite handy though. Um, yeah. Because at least I've not got three... But then it's quite hard if you're going for a specific one, like, oh, you could say, oh, I've got flower boppers, and then you could go there and get one. But That's a really good idea about doing it with your extra characters. I didn't think about that at all. And it's nice to see them out as well, get some more pictures. And the villagers are all right there, so they're interacting and such, because I think because I change my villagers so much and sometimes I don't play my certain characters for weeks, None of them actually even know any of the villagers. Yeah. Apart from Tabby. Like, every time I open John's mailbox, it's just, like, so much letters for Tabby because I think that's only <laughs> one that he's made a friendship because she's been here for so long. That's cute. And then it is cute, but then I'm thinking, oh, I feel... Because so, I'm, like, Tabby's my bestie. Like, what are you doing? <laughs> even though it is me playing. I finally logged on with Isabel. Um for the first time in ages this week because I realised that I hadn't changed her wall over from a snowy wall. Oh. <laughs> so she still had, she still, it was still snowing when you went into Isabel's house, even though her house has moved to a different place on the island. Yeah, I just and didn't get around to changing it. Really sunny outside. So she now has the chic wall, which was a very kind gift for her. And it looks really cool. It's very fitting for her. And it was nice to get her going around the island, meeting all the new villagers. And uh, yeah, it was lovely. Oh, that'll be good in the next few days. Because they'll be like, oh, did you see Isabel? (laughs) Yeah, yeah. And it was nice to see the real Isabel out on the plaza, hanging out on fireworks day. That was great. Yeah, but she's out there all day and all night. That, yeah. Because I think I'd left it on. My my switch on, I had just put it on sleep and I had woke up and uh, I had played it and it was like in the middle of the night. It was like three o'clock in the morning and Elizabeth's still out there. The fireworks had ended, but she was still there. Oh, I thought that she'd go at midnight when they finish. No, because Red mm. was still there before that, before midnight, but he wasn't opened. He was like, no, I'm shut, because I think he shuts at 10. Or was it? Well, why he, yeah, he was guys, go home if you've finished. Yeah. It's the same way Kit and Leaf as well, if you're still there, like, out and about, they'll just stay there. You wouldn't catch me staying past uh, five o'clock. <laughs> like, no, no, nine to five, I'm done. Oh, I'm they, they don't exactly have a nine to five job, so maybe they enjoy hanging about chilling out, relaxing in the island. Maybe they go around wandering. That's a nice thing to think. Oh. Did you see the net just uh, pop in from the side of the screen then? What was that? I think that was, that Flick. was Flick trying to ca- oh, catch Flick. a bug, I suppose. <laughs> Flick is on my island just now as well, but I'm on yesterday because I've still not caught up. Catching up from fireworks weekend. Yeah, and also <laughs> I've made a huge mistake I think I should be on Tuesday but Colton asked to leave when I was playing the other yesterday or this yeah yesterday and um, I said yes obviously I've got his picture and oh hi Flick and I've said yes and then I've changed the time but because I've been playing late at night I've been trying to play catch the bugs I've not been playing late at night I've changed the time to late at night to get some of the bugs right yeah and then I've turned, saved it turned it off and changed the, the date not realising it had been past 12 o'clock so the date had aut- automatically changed already I just had to change the time so Colton's I made the void by accident because oh, I no. changed it to oh. not till he was in boxes but till the day after skip two days Right, I'll look forward to having him turn up at my yeah. house at some point in the, <laughs> in the future then. But I was hoping somebody was going to ask because I was 
I think when I was picking up the messages in the bottle, I still like to pick them up and I've been selling yeah. the, the DIYs. Oh, well done. I'm or proud I've of you. left them. If I know <laughs> that it's a new one, I've left it for um, my one third character. Um, yeah. Because I think the other John's character's got quite a big uh, DIY crafting yeah. inventory, but the other one hasn't, so... Oh, that's a big step for you, Sandy. Well done. I know. I Back to the point, I'm just talking rubbish now. Um, I'm going to pick up my message in a bottle. I actually meant to pick it up before I came here and open it. And whoever has sent that DIY, that's who I'm going to go and try and hunt for on a villager hunt. Oh. Because I can't okay. do I can't do island hopping. Like, I can't do it. I can't say no to everyone, but, my, but I think if I've got, like, somebody in mind that I've not picked because I couldn't possibly pick somebody yeah. then I will go for it maybe wow. I'll need to see I will try so I'm going to pick up so the message it, in the bottle and that's island hopping day to day is it? yes it'll need to be a yeah, day I don't oh. know how long how long do you get before it autofills is it two days? Or? I think yeah in the next I think you get one one day oh one of day being empty Right, okay, so I'll need to go. I'll need to go today. Oh, you have to post on Instagram or keep us updated as to who you're looking for and who you find. Yeah. I was hoping to do it in front of you just so that I know it's like there and because I might pick it up when I go home and say, no, I'd really don't want to look for that one. <laughs> just so that I, I've got witness, I need to do it. I think unless it's someone that you've already met, You'd be up for anyone, wouldn't you? Yeah. There's not anybody yeah. that I would refuse. Because I'm not really looking for a specific personality. You're right. And you want to meet everybody eventually. Yeah. So this seems a good way to go about it. Yeah, that's cool. I like that idea. And I've still got the amiibos that I've not used because I only invited Marty and then I got rid of him before I got his photo. But I'm thinking, I don't know when I'm going to invite them. See, because I know I've got them and I can invite them any time. It's not as exciting and it doesn't feel like... It won't feel like the same as the other villagers that come from an island or have came through the void. Mm. Did you scan them all for their furniture? Yeah, I've scanned them all for their furniture. I guess maybe you could um, scan one if you've got somebody who you who's been there for a long time and hasn't asked to leave. Oh, yeah. But that you feel like you might want to move on, give a sort of gentle, encouraging nudge to. Yeah. Well, I've not had a campsite villager visitor for ages, it feels like. Oh, I got one this week. What? Who was it again? Lucha? Lucha, was oh, that the one of the birds? Oh, is he yeah, bridge? Lucha, yeah. Oh, he's cool. The re the wrestling one. Oh, I think him and uh, Phoebe would be cool on islands together. Yeah, uh, I didn't invite them. Quite happy with my lot at the moment. Are you still looking for photos then, for some? <laughs> yeah, I'm still waiting on uh, a photo from Willow. I guess maybe I didn't gift her like something every day this week, but she's still giving me complete junk <laughs> every day. <laughs> I think I got a I got a maxi shirt dress from her this week, definitely. Um, and then maybe a sleeveless parka, a vertical striped shirt, uh, a top hat. Football shirt. I got a new dog nose, but that was from Ketchup. I think I got some green paint flooring from Willow as well. But every day, I think, today's going to be the day. But not yet. No, I'm the same with Blair. She's not gave me her picture yet. She gave me this dress, though. It's quite nice. I thought it, was, it matched my, oh, my, nice. my heart boppers. I've been wearing it all week. The hibiscus moo moo. Yeah. But she's yeah, I like it. I've just flicks on my island, so I caught. She said she'd said something about a butterfly, uh, a bug being in her house or something like that, an exquisite bug. And I was like, all oh, right, okay. So 
Flick was on my island this morning, so I was like, oh, I'm going to catch some butterflies and make her a, a model, and I'll give her that tomorrow. Hopefully I'll get a picture from it. Because her house is um, quite nice, all flowery, so a butterfly in there would just make sense. Yeah. Yeah, it'd be cute. I didn't, I want. I really wanted the, is it the emperor butterfly? But it's the blue iridescent wings. They're just really nice. Like metallic wings, but they're not about. I know the so one. I she's just, she's just got name. a common blue bottle. But I quite like the look of them, but the name yeah. just puts me off because blue bottles are horrible. Like the flies. Oh, like the fly? Yeah. yeah. But the, the statue's nice. Yeah. I think that was my first statue that I got. Because that was the easiest thing to catch. Yeah. I think that you must be pretty happy still having Blair around, right? Because oh, yeah, she has, it means she's you can... Oh, yeah, she's got a flower shop. <laughs> yeah, she's got a beautiful flower shop outside her house, which is really cool. I guess there's quite a lot of flower-loving villagers, though, so yeah. you might just have to... When she moves, you might just have to move in a, a sisterly or... A che get Cherry back. <laughs> yeah, get Cherry back. Oh, actually... I just got, I just remembered, I'd get a photo today, I'm talking about Blair's photo, eh, not today, this week, I get Stitch's photo, which I was kind of gutted about, because I'd like him to hang about a wee while. Aww. But that's, that's super quick, photo. you must have been following him around, giving him yeah, excellent do you know what, I, presents every day. I have been, I have been giving him, gifting him every day, because I like to go and see him, even though he's like the furthest part of the island, it's still nice, it gives you a reason to go over the parts that I wouldn't normally frequent but yeah. I was quite surprised that you gave me a picture not complaining though I think I'm at the stage now where I might get ketchups before willows because I think that ketchups friendship level is high enough for that to yeah, be a thing I think, now. I think it must be snooties because I had the same problem with Robin and she, she was a snooty oh yeah you did and I'm not snooty. bothered though. I love yeah. Willow's a great villager to see around every day. I, I love having her. Although she said the funniest thing when uh, I was playing as Isabel. And I think it might have been the first time that I met her with Isabel. And she was like, oh, it's lovely to meet you. I really love it here and I look forward to getting to know you. Not today though. I can't talk because I've got to go and organise my shoe collection. And that was the end of the conversation. It's like, whoa. <laughs> it's nice quite, fellow. Quite, quite abrupt. Welcome to the island, but uh, yeah. See ya. I never said to you last week, you know, I went to the, I went to Harz to get some pictures of Coco and the Trier and the Headboppers. Yeah, I saw the pictures last it's week. Uh, so I had made while I was there I just got carried away so I changed the front room into like a cafe because I think I was like Brewster's not coming so I'm just going to make myself a cafe because obviously we meet in the usually the bar so I was thinking no, it would be a nice place to just get yeah. pictures of your villagers just sitting especially now that we can, we're going to be able to eat and drink so oh, yeah. that's what I, I've not took them there since I've been able to eat and drink I don't know what can you do that? you would be able to do it in a half surely Inside, you can do it inside. I don't know. I'll find out for you. I don't know. Yeah, find out. I don't see why not. No, because I'm sure I've already been eating inside. There's some things that you can't hold inside, aren't there? Like balloons and yeah, stuff that you put away. So, but don't see why you wouldn't be able to drink your tea inside. Yeah, because you can do like your party poppers and stuff like that, and you mm. can hold. Although they're not consumable, but you can hold the drinks in like the shamrock soda and the apple fizz. That's true, yeah. So I'll send you some pictures of me and my, my villagers hanging out at the cafe. You're going to have to build a public toilet in your cafe <laughs> in one of the rooms at Harv's then. Well, one of the rooms can be, I'll put a toilet sign in the, on the side of the door. Yeah. Oh, that would be cute if you could do, like you could use a simple panel to make a door, a little toilet door. And like have it going off to one of the oh, other rooms. Oh yeah, because I've actually put doors in my 
in my house I used, I got a bit of it looks like a screen, like a, a shutter door, but it was just in the bathroom, like in my main room into the bathroom. Yeah, I like that. So that's a good shot. I'm going to need to look for one like with a, a toilet sign on it. That's a good idea. I don't think that we need a cafe when everybody's so creative and makes such amazing ones themselves. Uh, yeah, I had a, like, I, it's not the cafe, I, want, I just want Brewster here. I don't mind if he's in the museum, but I had a conversation with Coco today and she was, oh, was it today or yesterday? I think it was yesterday. I went into her house and she's like, oh, you just, your outfit today just reminds me of a a coffee shop fanfic. And I was like, oh, huh. right, okay. I thought you were going to say uh, Coco said that your outfit reminds her of a pigeon. <laughs> a pigeon? All oh, right. Yeah. I was like, a pigeon? All oh, right, Brewster. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh. No, it's a cute outfit. I don't know. It doesn't, doesn't remind me of a pigeon <laughs> at all. Hi, <laughs> Coco. She's. I actually had a conversation with her and I must have not spoke to her for a while because, you know, it's like, oh, you're talking to me again or whatever. And I felt so bad and it happened to be barreled. I had that this week and I was like convinced that I'd spoken to that villager every day. Pearl said, oh, you're speaking to me again. You, well, like, what is it? You stopped giving me the silent treatment. Yeah. And I'm thinking, Pearl, you've only been here for a week and I've spoken to you almost every day because I've been wanting to like start gifting you and like getting to know you. So there's no way that I would I'd let her go without talking to her like for more than maybe two or three days. I wouldn't say that was the silent treatment. Maybe it was when the game updated there was some like maybe it did something weird. If you got it twice as well. Yeah, but I probably have been ignoring Barold and Coco because I think sometimes if I'm behind a couple of days, I'll just go and look for the ones that I need to give gifts to, so. Yeah. Probably has been me. It is hard to speak to them all every day sometimes, like, especially when they're hiding or they're off on their own little adventure on the island somewhere. I, I'm a bit lazy about running around and trying to find everybody every day. I'll go up and like look in all the all the houses and then I'll look around the sort of main few areas of the island but if they're not there then I don't worry too much. Oh yeah actually see because it fixed that museum thing I've been getting into the museum more to look for the villagers yeah. which has been nice. I caught Jeremiah in the the fish area the aquarium. Oh nice. Which was quite funny because he's a frog, but he gave me a fishing vest when I gifted him, which I thought was funny. I was like, as if I'm going to go and fish in the aquarium. Yeah, don't fish in there. <laughs> oh no, what was he doing in there? Hopefully he wasn't catching uh, his dinner. I, was, I always I took a picture one time, I was dressed as my frog outfit and I went and I was like, got a picture just standing, because there's a frog in the museum, so like standing in front of the... The museum brought up my text chat and I was like, Mom. <laughs> but it was quite funny. Okay, you're going to have to find that picture for us now. Oh, no. And you're off many, many thousands of pictures. Oh, I've got, oh, honestly, too many. I think I took about two, 200 pictures of fireworks this week for some reason. Yeah, I've got videos as well. I would try to video like the little sequence of fireworks, although I've not downloaded any villager ones like I'd said but I just had random ones I had up last year because they saved the, the sequence which was quite good um, that's right yeah but because I think I must have had different ones because I've got I don't know if you remember I've got like skeleton bones and well I did have it in the graveyard oh yeah in one of the dig sites and they were in the sky so I must have had something else before I've changed it to them because I was sitting watching, I was like, what is, th what is that? And I've had to look at my custom design. I had to go to Isabel to look at what was in the sequence. Oh. And it was like bones and... Oh. I can't remember what. I think it was a fence and decking and stuff like that. So I changed some of them just to 
like flowery ones that I had already saved but I haven't downloaded any. So looking forward to see to see everyone. Yeah, everyone I sat and watched yours for a little while and took some pictures. I really loved the way that your rainbow flag looked. Oh, that, that one comes out it really does well. look really good, doesn't it? Mm. And the pear tree, obviously, is great. Oh, yeah, because that was my pear tree that I was experiment making oh, like months ago. There were a couple that I couldn't quite figure out. Oh, yeah, like my eyebrows. <laughs> Do you know, I've never noticed that before. I mean, I've noticed that you have eyebrows, but I'd never thought that nobody else has eyebrows in the game. You can only do eyebrows through custom, having a custom design, right? Yeah, custom design. I think I've had this, I've, I'm a, this has been my oldest design because I think I've had them for like over a year <laughs> and I That's can't take amazing. them off. Well, I could that take them off, amazing. but I'll put them back on. Oh, obviously I, I had noticed that you had them, but I'd never put two and two together and thought that that must be a custom eyebrow design. I like there's so many designs for like eyebrows as well but what one thing I did have last year as well I did try it out but I just didn't like it was people have made custom like fringes like bangs oh so instead it although they'll have an eyebrow maybe or eyebrows and then they'll have bangs or just bangs so you put that on and they've got them in all the different colours of the hair styles uh, yeah. hair you can get so like people just they're just amazing what they're and they create because I would never have yeah, thought to like so inventive it's, it's incredible I love it to do eyebrows I, that's not something I would have thought to do as well I seen it and then I nope I just did it myself yeah it's remarkable yeah it's just another way to make the character more um, maybe not like you or more like personal um, to you because yeah. you can do that I'm not just talking about eyebrows because anything just Freckles or... You're right. Yeah, you're right. Because my guy is pretty generic. And then sometimes on the internet I'll be like, that's my guy. And I'll, I'll <laughs> it's, not, it's not my guy. It's just a very generic looking Animal Crossing character. Yeah, because I think early on when I used to, play, when I had a group of friends I played with, if we had a hat on and they would always recognise my character because I was the only one that was walking about with these eyebrows on. Hmm. Do you like my outfit today? Got the uh, fancy kimono and the chic tulip crown. That's the chic one, isn't it? Yeah. You, is that not what you yeah. wore last week? No, I had on... I think I had on my alpinist dress and my headband oh, so last week. Oh, so you did, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is... Party gear. I've got this on because um, I gave that kimono to Poppy... Oh, so so date. That's what is so familiar. And it's Poppy's birthday today, so I thought I'd put this on as a tribute because I did think I would wear the alpinist dress, but then I was like, "Oh, I wore that on the podcast last week, so yeah, uh, I'll change." And we went in to see her, didn't we, before we started recording? Yes. And had a little celebration. And ketchup was there. She was like trying to steal the limelight. From Poppy. <laughs> she was, yeah. <laughs> Getting in front of all the pictures. She's cute though. That's really cute because Ketchup and Poppy were visiting earlier in the week. So they're obviously becoming good friends. Oh, so they were planning their party earlier this week. That's oh, yeah, so maybe. Yeah. Ketchup, uh, yeah. Ketchup went around to Poppy's again earlier in the week. But it was lovely dropping in on her today. What present did you give her? Oh, oh! What did I give her? I don't know. What, what did you, you give her? I just know I get a layered tank back. Two settings. I'll check. Um, it would have either have been an acoustic guitar or a maple leaf umbrella. I'm just watching a video just now. No, it's oh, apples. Look great? Oh no, I've gave her apples. That's why I couldn't remember. So I've got I'm your. Sure she loved I've her got apples. your gift that I've picked up outside. 
I'll drop it back outside and we'll give it to her yeah. later. Oh, sorry. <laughs> That's okay. Don't worry, at least you didn't give her some <laughs> terrible item of clothing. Oh, no, I didn't know. I, I specifically wrapped purple for her, um, just a, for her gift, so I knew Aww. when she was. But um, you had obviously left gifts out that I picked up because that was obviously a more personal gift for her. Yeah, I had some help and advice from friends on the Discord about what to give her this morning and decorated her little uh, house a little bit with... Uh, she got the acorn arch outside, which I thought was really cute, and some tables of treats and birthday bits and pieces. As soon as I put down the um, birthday table that's got the big cake in the middle, Biscuit just like ran up and like started <laughs> investigating it. Was he sniffing I think it? He might have, uh, yeah, I think he might have done a big sniff. He's like, that's not for you, Biscuit. You have to wait to wait and uh, see if Poppy will share. I think Poppy would share. She's very kind. Yeah, when I went into the party, I was talking to Ketchup and she was just saying how good birthday decorations are and they think it'd be okay to leave have them out all year so she must have liked your your decorating I think she said to me that she wished it was someone's birthday every day and then she realised that it probably was someone's birthday every day and then she got excited about celebrating somebody having cake every day I love it the birthdays in the game are really really cute I was watching a stream this week and someone had their Animal Crossing birthday, their first Animal Crossing birthday in the game, and that was really cool. Oh, yeah, because a, a lot of people wouldn't have started playing until later in the year as well. Yeah. I've never really been a big birthday in real life person, so Animal Crossing has really kind of like brought birthdays to life for me. It's the same with fireworks, right? I could not care less about fireworks in real life. I think they're like a kind of pointless waste of money and they really upset all the dogs. So that really upsets me. But in Animal Crossing, watching your villagers get really excited just makes it amazing. And it's yeah. now like my favourite Animal Crossing event of all time because their excitement is so palpable. They're just like screaming at the sky and applauding and yelling and shouting at you and just... I know, I, I was quite, I forgot about them shouting. I remember, I've got a picture, I think, is me and you from last year and it was you shouting in my face. I yeah. Know. But then I was sitting on the bench outside resident services. I think Colton was doing the same. I was like, oh, I forgot they like actually shout at you. Yeah. I don't know if he was doing it on purpose or it was just the way he was sitting because he was sitting awkwardly, he was sitting facing like obviously the airport so he can't really see the fireworks but he's like tilted right. his head like going round. <laughs> <laughs> They're so funny. Their excitement is just so infectious though. That's great. I had such a good time. I definitely would like to do something again this Sunday. Yeah, and I'm going to need to try to make it. I'll need to be my baby a bit later, but hopefully it'll, I'll make some other islands. Oh, because I've got another four weeks. Well, I should at least catch one. I'm sure I'll catch more than one, but that'll be good fun. And eat some snacks. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to lay on a public toilet for the <laughs> for any visitors. Yeah, that, that does need to put that as a requirement for anyone who's hosting. You need to provide yeah. facilities. Yeah. Otherwise, your rocks are getting smashed. No, I wouldn't smash anyone's rocks. <laughs> I didn't do any island work this week at all, except for um, the terrible mess that I made of my entrance. Remember that I said I was going to flatten my entrance so that we had a bit of a bigger sort of area to look at the fireworks? Yeah. So I did that. I took down the little raised bit that led you 
right up to the plaza. And then I thought, ah, oh, I know, I'll put one of those cute little stone bridges over a pond. Because it's nice to have like a little, just a tiny little raised bit to stand yeah. on. So I kind of like measured it all up, ordered the bridge, like time travel to the next day. So the bridge was built. And I was like, great. So I decorated it all. Thought, brilliant. I kept it quite kind of open and not too much decoration. Just a few flowers, a couple of benches. I did the bamboo bench so that you could like, so that you can sit on it both ways. So you can be facing either direction. I really yeah. like that bench because of that. Um, and then I think only when I flew back from somebody else's island did I notice that it's just one square off to the left. I was so gutted because I thought I'd put it exactly in the middle as you walk out of the airport. Exactly in the middle of like the airport and resident services and right in the middle of that from left to right but it's just off to the left a little bit right you can hardly notice it unless you're walking straight down from there but i don't know if i can face redoing it to be honest does it look when you're on it like when you're standing on it can you see it's off center or like off or anything because i took a picture yeah. there and it looked... you kind of can it depends so it where you put from, your camera. Is it off from the resident services or off from the airport or both? Yeah, both. Because if you walk in a straight line from the airport, you go to the door of resident services. So you do have a they're, straight, proper straight line? Yeah, they're, rail. Oh, yeah, right. they're directly in line. So it's not one at all. So it being one off to the left is just like... You've got a couple a of annoying. days to think about it or do it or... I know. It just depends, doesn't it, how I want that to look after August. Whether I might want sort of an autumnal entrance again. I did really like how it was, how I had it before, with that little raised bridge to walk yeah. over. But it was purely decorative, so I don't know whether I might want to do something a bit different. Yeah, because obviously the, um, when it's autumn, because what did you have, bamboo up there? Or oh, you changed it to trees, didn't you? Was it bamboo? Yeah, I just changed it to the cedar trees, but yeah. yeah, if we were going to autumn, I might change it to hardwood. So they get that nice colour. Or something completely different, maybe. Yeah. I've never done anything on my island either. I've just created that little bit down at the beach I don't know if you yeah you, you obviously seen it that was oh where thing we I sat did. and watched the fireworks that yeah. was cute I you think had a I had view from down there yeah I had a big space I always seem to use that space it's just a nice big space for like events or to place things I had to, I've done a lot of things down in that area so I just thought I might as well use it because it's quite close to the airport for ease but that was about it we had the game show down there. That was great. I remember that. Oh, the game show, yeah. Because I had that's when I had my bar down there as well, and my. Aye. Well, that was a long time ago. That was been a year ago. Yeah, I think over a year now. Uh, Last summer. Any other news or gossip? No, I'm going to be about time that I'm going to need to like change my my dream code. Otherwise, I'm going to hold out to Halloween again. <laughs> I didn't realise, but if you look in your passport app, it tells you how many times people have visited your dream. Oh yeah, I've seen that. I don't think I've had that many visitors. I've had 44 visitors to my dream. And I last updated it four months ago. And four months ago, I also did a dream visiting Lockroom. Oh, and that was when you had your... Um, race of the year I think oh yeah that would have been that yeah. so is your dream still um, from about Easter with all the the race stuff there yes it will be yep cool oh don't delete it until I've had another chance to have a play that was fun so did yeah. you have any other movement this week any other 
um, no, photos so just, or just comings that and she's goings. Just Colton, and that's about it. Stitch his photo, but he's he's staying though. Yeah, yeah, he's staying just now. Yeah, but and I had just realised Bianca. She has been here for weeks now, and I haven't even done anything to her garden. She's replaced Audie, who had like a beach cafe. Like that's that was that house was put there for her. But now I just don't know what to do, and I feel so bad now because I haven't even done anything. I not even gave her a flower outside or a plant pot. So I'm going to. I was to, wondering when I visited. The other day, it's like, whose house is this? It's not. It's not anything here. And then I remembered it was uh, Audie's house and yeah. Bianca's. So I'll um, see who oh. I have to look for, um, and when I get my uh, my new villager, I might move them to the beach and Bianca up next to Blair. Cause that's a nice area, mm, and hopefully yeah. that person is that villager is more suited to the beach whoever I get mm. oh that's really exciting I can't wait to see what you're gonna I know I'm, I think I might just need to run down and steal your message bottle no, oh kidding. yeah you can do that if you want <laughs> I don't even know where it is at the moment is it not down at the, the pier, pier maybe mm. I see it every time I go down there I just don't even notice it anymore because I've deliberately left all the stars on the beach Oh, right, so you just like kind of ignore all the stuff lying about. Yeah. I think it looks really nice with them washed up and like the stars washed up on the shore. So, and the shells, I think, look really nice there as well. So, I never really pick them up. Oh, yeah, I, I love the summer shells. I will hate, hate when they go. They're just a really nice color and they just look so, much, so pretty. Well, if you pick them up when they go, you can just drop them back down there and they'll stay. Like I've done with the stars. Mm, oh, that's good. I should have knew that. Mm. I need to do that. Although I was needing to pick up shells to finish all the the summer like shells. Oh yeah, but DIYs. Oh, you can I make some nice stuff them. with them, though, can't you? Yeah. Cool. So, any plans for the week ahead? Island hopping, Island fireworks, hopping. Party, fireworks party, eating lots, going to the toilet lots. Yeah, all of their above. Just the, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> cool, me too. Yeah, thanks for having me, Luke. And thanks everyone for listening. Remember, we are on social media, your Twitter, your Instagram. And also, if you'd like to support the podcast, we are on Patreon. Yeah, and our, our Discord's open for anybody to come and hang out with us and carry on chatting as well so everybody's welcome and join the fireworks parties yeah and join the fireworks parties <laughs> cool thanks for coming it's been great catching up yeah thanks for having me I'm going to need to go and steal your bottle now you go for it <laughs> <laughs> cool thanks everyone for watching and listening I hope you all have a good week bye bye Oh, me up now, me up, me up, me up. Oh. Now, me quick, quick, oh, me up, me quick, quick. Now, me up, up, me up, me quick, quick. Oh. Me up now, me up, me up, me up. Oh. Now, me quick, quick, up, me up, me quick, quick. Knock me up, up, me knock me quick, quick. Me, me up, quick, quick, now, now up. Me. Me oh, quick, quick, now, now, oh, oh. Me, me oh, quick, quick.